Hi everybody, it's Mark from Dunedin Mark Leisure Kingdom. Thank you for joining me today here at Dunedin Mark Leisure in Hilton, Derbyshire. So this afternoon I have for you a treat in the form of a gorgeous metallic ruby red Autotrail V-Line 610 SE. So it's a 2020 registered vehicle on a 70 reg. It's done just a tad over 11,500 miles. So not massive mileage for a vehicle of its age. And it's absolutely gorgeous. It's all the reasons why you need a two berth, six meter van conversion, ready for your holidays going into 2024. Um, it's got these really, really nice Fiat commercial black and chrome finished alloy wheels. It's on a 2.3, 140 horsepower, six speed manual gearbox. In the cab, it's got the blinds. So you've got driver's door, passenger door and windscreen blinds. And then I will show you all about the multimeter features because it's got the upgraded Zenet he uh, head unit in there as well. Yeah. Uh, when we get onto the inside. So at the minute we've got the fridge vents. So it's got a three way fridge freezer inside. Uh, it runs off gas 12 volt and 240. Just inside there is your toilet cassette. So nice and simple to use. Just underneath at the bottom you can see the blue and grey. So one is your clean water tanks, one is your wastewater tank. And then just here you've got the Truma boiler vent. So it's a combi heating system. And then just behind that, underneath there is your electric hook up point. Really big windows, all the in windows have internal blackout blinds and fly screens as well. And all of the skylights have blackout blinds and fly screens. Big barn doors to the rear of the van and then just above in that little pod at the side of the LED high level brake light. You can see there's a reverse camera. You've got the really nice LED strip lights that run right the way through to the front of the van as well. And this one also has a tow bar. The bench seats are just a tad over six foot long so you can use them as a nice lounge area for a day van if you want to go and have a day trip to the garden center or somewhere off into the dales if you're fortunate enough to live around this area and then you can have a free a table that fits into the port on the floor uh, with a little tabletop and you can use it as your lounge dining space or alternatively as a night time you can use it as two single beds or one really big double bed um, these are the blackout blinds so they pull up and then they clip together so in the summer season when it's nice and warm you can leave the windows open let the air pass through and stop all the creepy toilets from coming in uh, really well insulated and you can see it also comes with the avtex television um, that was left in by the previous owner so it will be staying with the vehicle and on the left hand side here you've got storage that runs right the way through to the opposite end of the sofa that's where your awning winder is and then on the right hand side underneath here you've got a small amount of storage but then you've got all your like boiler, leisure battery, a lot of bits and bobs underneath there. So, just shut the door too. Round to the passenger side and you've got the runner for the slide door. LPG gas fill. So underneath it's got a fixed LPG gas tank. So you can just fill it from any uh, external gas fill site. Big wind out canopy that goes right the way along there. And then you've got the LED strip light that runs a lot across the top of the slide door. When you open this, you've also got your awning light so that's nice so it lights up all this outside space and you've got your electric step before you actually go in give that a bit of a push when you are inside this is just to show you that you've got a worktop extension and you've got an additional three pin socket there so if you have got like a driveway awning or something set up on the side of the van mm -hmm. when you're plugged into the mains you can plug your socket into there run power outside and then have an extension lead in your awning with all your gadgets gizmos air fryer radio extra kettle whatever you want uh, really really nice size fridge freezer and this is three way so it runs off 12 volt hook up or gas so if you are doing wild camping the gas yeah. is really going to come into its own above the habitation door behind you you've got the control panel so main power on and off that's your lights down the bottom of the van uh, external lights levels check so vehicle battery leisure battery water and waste water pump and then these are just light switches that's the control panel for the heating and hot water then in the kitchen area you've got this nice size sink plenty of storage all underneath yeah. and then you've got the microwave three ring gas hob and then just here you have your oven and grill just opposite there the door is slightly recessed back so you've got lots of space to get through which is always nice yeah. then you've got that all-in-one toilet and shower wet room 
And then a clever little feature that Auto Trail give you on the V-Line is just in this cupboard because the solar panel system on the roof, that's your charger, is this little switch. So normally with van conversions, your solar panel will charge your laser battery. But this one, if you're putting the van into storage and not using it that often, what yeah. you can do, flick the switch down to the bottom, turn it on to where it says leisure battery and it will keep your leisure battery topped up or flip it the other way. Turn it to the top where it says vehicle battery and it means that you can get in, start the engine, drive off and then if your leisure battery is low but your vehicle battery is charged, it will charge the leisure batteries while you're driving. Um, lots and lots of storage right the way across the top of the van so you've got these big storage lockers all the way across both sides. So there's plenty of room in there for his and hers. And then down at the front into yeah. the cab we've got that upgraded Zenec, uh, Exent sorry, um, head unit system. So that's got the reverse camera for the back, so you can push the button while you're traveling and it will to activate the camera. And it's also got sat-nav and DAB radio built in as well. Controls are on the steering wheel for that and it also has cruise control. And um, then you've got all the functions for using the air conditioning while you are driving as well. It's electric front windows, driver and passenger. And then we've got lots of additional storage lockers. So you've got this nice big wardrobe behind the driver's seat and you've got the storage locker above the uh, cab as well. Um, the van conversions are absolutely brilliant, just a tad under six meters in total length, three and a half tons so they can, can be driven on a standard car license. And you've got to think that every van of this size is an Amazon delivery van, DPD delivery vans. If they can fit, you can. So there's no reason why you can't use one of these all the year round and for anywhere you want to go. For any more information, if you'd like to speak to me, don't be afraid to ask for me when you make that telephone call. My name's Mark. I hope you've enjoyed the video today and find it really informative. Be excited. Look forward to spring 2024 and we've got plenty more vans in stock. So again, if you'd like any more information, give us a call. See you soon. Thank you.